For your case, you chose nuclear. Uh -huh. In my case, nuclear chose air. My decision was the urgent need of my country, Nigeria, for a reliable and sustainable energy. Nuclear is the answer. Nuclear engineering has a lot more math courses, and I love math. So I was like, if I can do that, then like, okay, you know? So that's kind of how I was exposed to the nuclear field and, and ended up becoming a nuclear engineer. When I told my people that I want to study nuclear engineering, they, they were like, what? Uh -huh. What is nuclear? Yeah, like you, nuclear? You want to study bomb? I, I was like, oh, oh no, oh no, that, that is not it. Why that specific choice of all the things that you could do? That's the reaction that I tend to get most of the time, like people are, yeah. are surprised. It's always that question. Are you scared? How do you get ready? Is it dangerous? Yeah, because people are scared of things that they don't know. Mm -hmm. And I actually think it's kind of cool to be in the nuclear industry because we can kind of teach people about the misconception. Go for it. I mean, when you've thought about going for STEM, that means you've taken the first step. Of course. Yes. There will be many people saying, oh, you are not confident, you cannot do it, this might be very difficult. But be confident and trust yourself that you can do it. Just jump in, speak up. People underestimate women so often. Mm. And really, you can do it. Mm. Just be curious and be confident.